All right, so we're gonna go through ball handling workout. Got my guy Manny here, pro basketball player. So biggest thing when it comes to ball handling is we wanna make it as game realistic as possible. Now, obviously we don't really have a defender, so we're gonna have to get a little creative with how we do that uh, with certain cues, make him kind of read and react a little bit without a defender. So if you have a defender, even better, that's kind of what you guys should focus on. But mainly we're just gonna kind of touch on some change of speed stuff and some movement stuff. That's kind of mainly what he needs. So that's what we're gonna get into. Let's get it. Just gonna go heavy foots, right hand down, left hand back, we're just gonna do that twice. So we're just slow, speed, slow. Again, just keeping your hand on top. If you bring it under a little bit, it's fine because I want you to over exaggerate it. Okay. Really slow down, really speed up. No dribble, I'm saying. You get one, one pound. Yeah, like that. But you gotta go fast. So quick, slow, quick. Now that's better. Did you stand up on that? Okay. You let the ball come up a little more. If you keep it by your hip, you're not going to be able to get all the way up. You might have to let the ball raise up a little more. Try to do it one more time. How'd that feel? Better? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's the thing, everyone thinks your dribble's always gotta stay at the hip. And then it kind of f you up when you try to do like that. Now we're going the uh, delayed betweens. So you can either kind of just jolt your leg or you can readjust it. So you can kind of drop back into it and go. Again, quick burst, slow down, quick burst. Do it again. Just make sure you're paying attention to the position you're in when you explode. So if you're doing this versus if you're kind of getting in a good position to actually explode. Actually explode out like a full step. And then slow down. It's better, do it again. Right after your quick burst, again, you're letting that ball float, right? Where, float, let's go. That's fine, what was wrong with that? It's not gonna be perfect every time. You gotta keep going. You're just crossing out of it, yep. So you're Okay. I can still jump back. Hmm? I can still pop back. What do you mean? Like you said, I can either pop back. Yes. Yeah. You can either here or you can pop your back foot. Okay. Whatever's comfortable. Yeah. You figure it out. Last one was better, yeah. yeah I was getting too wide. I yep. Them. Yep. The last one, I, I closed. Yep. And you want to make sure you're pushing out the back foot first, right? Because yep. you got to sell the drive. Yep. I eat better than that. Push out the back foot. Too wide. Sorry. Right. Yeah. One, one more time, yep. Oh. 
Here, come back, come back, come back. I want you exploding out, out of every cross. Because I know you like to do this and you like to hit somebody and then you just come right back. But you don't get anywhere, right? Yeah. So I actually get out and get somewhere with yeah, it. Two yeah. Cool. And then you can kind of retreat it back if you want. So I do that shit. Yeah, you just do that shit all the time. Good call. Sell your way that way. How am I standing straight? Huh? I'm standing up tall. No, you're just kind of just. Like you're not actually shifting towards the ball. There you go. And make sure you're getting out, right? I got a first out. I was stopping, popping, yep. Let's just go last one. We're just gonna go down and back one time. Same thing, and then I just wanna change direction. So whether that's one dribble after, two dribbles, don't care. I don't care if it's a hop, wrap, load, doesn't matter. Tell me. Behind the back. Hmm? I was behind the back. It's fine. I stopped on that. I was It's fine. Give me two free throws just to break it up, catch your breath. Come back over here. Still going, change the speed. Start basic, build on it. Make you kind of react to my stuff. So we're going through and then we're just misdirection float. Working on being able to pocket the ball, pull it back and then change speed. So you're. Got it. How much space can you cover? And then while keeping the ball controlled. And on, with your hand on top. How am I getting this? 45 degree angles. Doing right? Yeah. Are you doing it right? Yes. You're doing it great? No. Is that as much space as you can get? This is. Get some. Thank you. Yeah. That's the challenging part. Not bad. However your body can move, the ball's gotta be able to just come with it. Slow down though in between. That's where you gotta relax. Same thing to start. And then you're gonna drop and go. Drop, go. All while keeping your hand on top. That's gonna be the hard part. Nah. What do you think? I feel like you split the other way. No, you went the right way. But you went. Oh, so I gotta get that photo placement. 
While floating ball. You did. You didn't see the difference? Dribble after. Yeah. So no dribble. Go down and back, add a change direction, drop, drive, one dribble change. Yep. Yeah, start in the middle. And then it has to be a different change of direction every single time. So you can't do the same one. You can't do the same one. Down and back, same direction, can't do the same one twice. That's gonna be tough. Down and back? Yep. Different change of direction every time. Got him. We got him. Woo! You almost did the same one. Go, go ahead. Come on. I don't want you to give you time to think. Let's go. Oh yeah! Oh, you did that! Yeah! You're gonna have to do that little replay feature on that one, boys. Woo! Wait, what was that drop? You're doing it right. This one. Yeah, you're going down and back, same hand. Same hand? Like, it's the same way. You gotta restart because you did that one too already. Oh my god. Well, there's any you can do to get over to the other side. Are you kidding me? I can give you 10 different ones. All right, off the it. dome. I got it, I got it. Okay. Man, I love, how, I love how you stretched it out so you only had to get two reps. I love it, I love it, I love it. Go the other way, other hand. Bouncing left. Yeah, but you stopped in between. You can come on back because you stopped in between. I already did that one. And wasted 10 seconds, come on back. I said you gotta continuously flow with it. There you go. Go. Anyways, same thing. I'm gonna give you a number, one, two, or three. That's how many moves you do, explode out. Got it? And you gotta flow right into the next one too. Three, one, two, three, get out. And then bounce and go again, right away. Make sure you're really slowing down on that float. Got it? Yes, Let's get it. One. Three. Keep going, go, 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 it's fine. One. Oh, no. Three. I like it. One. Three. Two. And you're just coming up and then you're gonna get any change of speed you want. So you can get into that heavy foot, you can get into like a misdirection float like we just did, anything you want. And then I'm gonna give you a point, that's the direction you gotta go. So I might point here and then change it, you just gotta react to it. Okay. Anything you want to go that direction. Okay, so like if you change, right? So you could be coming to a float, and I'm um, here, and then, and then I might cut you off, right? That? Yeah. Uh, so you just gotta react to it. Uh, you can't it. Are you ready? Let's go. Go, go, go. Oh, you gotta be in front of me too. There you go. Like I said, gotta make it as game realistic as possible, you know?
Got him. Off the simplest one, too. Lockdown defense. Yep, back. There you go. That's it. Mm -hmm. Appreciate you, bro. Short and sweet. So, like I said, quick ball handling workout nothing crazy you just want to get something quick in for you guys so you guys can try some of these things out yourself or with some of your players uh, Manny Ashley's about to sign with the team yes, sir. Uh, you can kind of talk about briefly briefly yeah um, not supposed to discuss much but I'll just basically tell you guys that I will be heading um, back overseas next year and with the opportunity to go play with the team for two years actually a two-year contract non-negotiable well non guarantee for my second year um, and yeah, man, we just been basically betting on ourselves. As you guys know, I came home uh, basically with nothing, empty-handed, um, and we just put in the work. And every day, we're just trying to get better and yeah. keep growing to our potential and trying to reach exactly where we're trying to go to. So um, yeah, man, I appreciate everyone that's been supporting us. I mean, he's been having big, big news and big things happening. So, so have I um, and the rest of our team. So. We're just gonna continue to keep working and try to get better day by day. Yes, sir. Simple.